In Taksu village in southern Bhutan, restaurant owner Ram Badagurung works and lives in the dark. The restaurant, which also doubles as his home, does not have any electricity. Beyond the inconvenience, the lack of electricity is taking a toll on his business. Many travelers passing by look for cold drinks in this hot weather, but we cannot have a refrigerator to store drinks. If we had electricity, we could have not just a refrigerator, but a fan too, and we can serve better food to our customers. There would also be better sanitation. Gimthang village also used to be blanketed in darkness. It was only four years ago that the community received electricity. 76-year-old farmer Pen Jor, a lifelong village resident, remembers life without electricity as much more challenging. We had to carry firewood on our backs from a very long distance. And because it was dark, we could not see. We had to handle it. Today, Pen Jor enjoys the convenience of having electrical power. The Asian Development Bank supported the electrification of all 309 households in Penjor's community. It is just one small part of a larger assistance package for Bhutan, which to date has extended electricity coverage to half of the country's rural families. At an average cost of just six U.S. dollars a month, electricity comes cheap in Bhutan, making it affordable even for households of humble means. The country's electrical power is exclusively derived from environmentally friendly hydropower sources. Blackouts are virtually unheard of. We have come out of the darkness and into the light. From the moment we wake up and turn on the lights, we're very happy to see electricity. Energy deprivation traps families in poverty. Mindful of this fact, Bhutan has embarked on an ambitious program to provide every single home in the nation with electricity by 2013. With every home and business alight, Bhutan will have taken a major step towards freeing families like Penjors from abject poverty.